the legacy of this franchise and the studio, so we are not going to be discussing future-looking projects here. So we are not going to be discussing future-looking projects here. And you're going to see a lot more of this game come next year. And you're going to see a lot more of this game come next year. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're a little more calmed down from my last video where we discussed The Last of Us Day 2023 and everything that happened with that. I just want to thank you guys so much for all your support recently on all my videos in regards to Naughty Dog and The Last of Us. This will be one of my last update videos for the year on multiplayer, on the multiplayer game, because I don't really think there's going to be much more. You may see another video prior to the Game Awards show, because that is when I think the next possibility of us hearing even a clamor of it. As I told you guys in the last update video, there was expectations that maybe we would have heard about the multiplayer game at The Last of Us Day. Unfortunately, Naughty Dog said nothing. And as I said in my last video, I continue to get more and more worried about this project the longer the silence goes on. Again, every inclination I have seen recently is that the Naughty Dog devs are still reiterating that the game is being worked on. That it is not cancelled, like a lot of people have told me. As the year wraps up, I'm gonna have a little update here, just discuss some things I've seen the last couple days, and discuss the outlook for the multiplayer game. What are we looking forward to with it? Since it is still in production. If you guys do enjoy this, please be sure to drop a like, subscribe if you're new. Join about that near 30% of people that are subscribed by hitting that red subscribe button notification bell have it set to all so you don't miss any videos discussing the last of us slash naughty dog and turn about that near 100,000 people that have all notifications on from the channel we can go for 1,000 likes on this video greatly would appreciate it and thank you again for watching enjoy so everything that's happened in the past like the last of us day and all that we're moving on from that i'm not really going to go through that and get angry i already had that video so we're moving on from that I'm not going to keep the negativity train rolling so we know the game is not canceled we know it is still in development but based on the longer the silence is going we know that this delay now i don't believe it's a minor delay anymore i believe whatever happened this bungee evaluation the whole thing that jason trier and bloomberg leaked out to the public i do believe this is a huge huge delay and what does that mean it means we're not going to get the game anytime soon i don't think it's coming out early next year i don't think it's coming out middle next year maybe at the earliest late next year but again i even think that's what thinking. i'm starting to really think this game may not even come out till 2025 and that is actually insane that will mean if this is naughty dog's next project and let's say they don't hypothetically drop the director's cut of part two and even then that's not a new game it will have been five years almost since naughty dog dropped a new title think about that five years we are almost halfway to the ps5 like well, i talked about this in my last video that will be absolutely inexcusable in my opinion from a company like naughty dog i know they take their dang time but this is to a new limit next year i'll make a release date prediction but i'm gonna tell you all right now i'm starting to really lean towards 2025 and i know that probably is gonna be like you guys are like what the hell yes with all this silence, I'm not surprised. Now, what about that update we were promised this year? Play the clip. And you're gonna see a lot more of this game come next year. Next year, so I wait till next year to hear more next about that year. one. Okay. And it wasn't just Neil who reiterated this, Naughty Dog themselves said it too. Keep a lookout, our biggest online experience is coming. More news next year, and this was on June 9th, 2022, after the reveal at the Summer Games Fest. And at the beginning of the year, what did Naughty Dog say? We'll have some fun surprise for you along the way, but later this year we'll begin to offer you some details on our ambitious last multiplayer game. Well, guess what? That never happened. Because they delayed it. So all this promise, not just from last year, even this year, at the beginning of this year, they promised us. And what happened? Nothing. Now again, there's still two, three months left in 2023, so I'm not going to say, you know, nothing to that. But I'm willing to be very, very confident in saying that there will not be any news the rest of this year. 
not even a continually squat thing from Naughty Dog. I'm telling you right now. And I appreciate all the people in my last video that basically feel sorry for me. Feel sorry for a lot of us. Again, this is the life I've chosen. I've covered Telltale Games, a company that went bankrupt for five years. I'm used to this. I'm used to this waiting game. It's, it's my life with YouTube, which is why I've had to shift my focus to other games and do other things. But these games are always like top notch and I always love covering them. So I'm the one that is willing to put through the waiting and suffer as well as a lot of you guys that watch these videos along with me. Now, Neil made the point clear that they're gonna be announcing games closer to release. So whenever we do hear stuff about this, it's gonna be close to release. Meaning, like I said, if it does come out late next year or 2025, we may not even hear about this till, I, like that major update slash news until maybe, realistically, middle to late 2024. I mean, between summer to the later months. Seriously, I'm not joking. I really think that is probably what is going to happen. And which is why, like I said, when we get into next year, I'll probably discuss that more in detail about what I think. But that's just a little preview because I'm telling you guys right now, you're not going to hear anything this month. Happy October, by the way. You're not going to hear anything next month. Maybe December at the Game Award Show, but if not, no. And then January is going to come up. And maybe there'll be something there where Naughty Dog is going to say the, the typical nothing to say. Or they'll be like, hey, you're going to hear more about our multiplayer game this year. Because, man, when they say that, I'm not going to believe could it at least squat. I'm telling you that right now. Ryan's retiring. I don't know if that's going to play in factor with Naughty Dog. A lot of people blame Jim Ryan for why there's been more silence recently from PlayStation Studios. I'm not saying it's going to change immediately. But Jim Ryan, I don't think, is leaving until early 2024, I think March. So, I don't know. Maybe whoever takes the reins of Sony now will actually, or at least PlayStation, will pump up the pressure for some of these studios to actually show some stuff to their fans. No offense, because some of us here were dying for anything at this point. It's almost been five months since the delay announcement. I don't know when this will end, guys. So I'm just t warning you all to prepare for more and more waiting. And it stinks, but as they say, Joel and Ellie, endure and survive. That's literally what you're gonna have to do because I don't really see a light at the end of the tunnel right now, at least in the coming months. So you're just gonna have to stay patient. I'm still hoping Naughty Dog gives us that director's cut or something to make sure this weight is not unbearable, but let's be honest, we're probably not going to hear anything for a while. So I'm already buckling down and getting ready to cover other stuff on this channel, and that's okay. But you guys, you know, I'm, you know people in the last video were still saying the same thing, like Dami's still going to cover the last stuff. Of course, of course, whenever there's news, of course. And if we hear any rumblings or any new updates or news, of course. But I kind of want to just give you a little update on when the timetable of things, what's going on with the project. Because it's still happening, it's still in development, so look at that as a positive. But as I said, you're not going to probably hear anything the rest of this year. But keep an eye on the Game Awards regardless. Maybe Neil will throw in a surprise announcement there or a surprise trailer or something. I'm not counting on it though. So, um... Get ready for 2024. It's nearly two months from happening, so. If you guys did enjoy this video, please be sure to drop a like, subscribe if you're new. Let's go for a thousand likes on this video, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Endure and survive, and I'll catch y'all later. Peace. No more to roam. I'm just a Oh